If you've watched the movie Armageddon, then I'm pretty sure that you have a good taste in music. The movie is garbage, but hell, Aerosmith really makes you feel like watching an asteroid bombing, the most satisfying thing ever. Now imagine if that asteroid were to hit Earth without Bruce Willis and his team. Well, you'll probably not see our latest uploads. Welcome to X-List, where we talk about all the craziest things on Earth. But this time around, we're going to space. Today, we're going to be talking about the top 10 asteroids that can destroy the Earth in minutes. Number 10. 15 Eunomia First on our list is the Eunomian asteroid 15 Eunomia. Discovered by Annabelle de Gaspari on July 29, 1851, this asteroid is the largest stony S-type asteroid among its peers. Its diameter is around 268 kilometers, or 166.53 miles. Basically, this asteroid is as big as going from Jacksonville Beach to Tallahassee. It has an estimated total weight of 1% of the mass of the entire asteroid belt, which is about 2.39 times 10 to the power of 21 kilograms. That is 22 zeros, and that is a lot of zeros, which is like the average grade of an engineering student. The 15 Eunomia asteroid is shaped like a guitar pick, and it could potentially destroy Earth in just a matter of minutes once it puts the D in Rif and started drifting into our atmosphere. For comparison, Earth's mass is 5.972 times 10 to the power of 24 kilograms, which is a lot heavier than the asteroid by a large margin. But 15 Eunomia is still pretty big and heavy enough to cause a mass extinction. Number 9. 31 Euphrosine The asteroid, named 31 Euphrosine, is considered a minor planet. This extra-large asteroid is almost the same, in an estimated average of 268 kilometers in diameter, with some extra 5 to 6 kilometers in length difference. Euphrosine was discovered by James Ferguson, the first astronomer to discover an asteroid in North America. This asteroid is considered a C-type asteroid, which has an icy composition. Some asteroids have deep basins, but for this one, there were none. Number 8. 87 Sylvia at more than 271 kilometers at best, 168.39 miles, the 87 Sylvia is the first ever asteroid discovered with more than one moon. This asteroid weighs from 1.41 times 10 to the power of 19 to 1.44 times 10 to the power of 19 kilograms. That's right, fellas. It's not just this asteroid's gonna bump on us. It also has its harem of two moons crashing into our beautiful planet. But for real, though, Asteroids are just poor rocks that didn't pass the vibe check to become a planet. And now they're out for blood, as they're going to test the waters to send us back to the Stone Age, literally. Asteroids are just failed planets, generally speaking. So, 87 Sylvia with a moon or two isn't really surprising. Number 7. 511 Davida This asteroid rocks up to 310 kilometers, or 192.63 miles, in diameter and was discovered by Raymond Smith Dugan in 1903. 511 Davida boasts a weight equivalent to 1.5% of the mass of the entire asteroid belt. Not much to say about this particular asteroid, except the fact that it's a C-type asteroid, which means it's a carbonaceous, chondrite type of asteroid. C-type rocks account for only 4.6% of observed meteorite Earth landings. You can't really hope that something as big as this Davida asteroid will make a direct critical hit on us. But let's just hope Earth has a high dodge chance. Plus, we have Mars to protect us from other asteroids trying to have a meet-and-greet apocalyptic event. Number 6. 5-2 Europa Up next, we have the 5-2 Europa. Don't confuse this asteroid for one of Jupiter's moons, Europa, since this is a 5-2 Europa, not a Jupiter Europa. But it's not like Europa and 5-2 Europa aren't from the same place. After all, moons are just failed planets that happen to be captured in other planets' gravitational pull due to collisions and co-formation. Anyway, back to our space rock. 5-2 Europa was discovered by Hermann Goldschmidt in February 1858. The 5-2 Europa asteroid weighs as much as 2.26 times 10 to the power of 19, or at least two sextillions of Burger King Whoppers. Number 5. 704 Interamnia Considered to be the fifth largest asteroid discovered, 
The 704 Interamnia is an F-type asteroid. It's like the C-type asteroid or the B-type, except it lacks the water absorption feature, which is common for most asteroids. It has a massive weight of around 3.79 times 10 to the power of 19 kilograms. It travels for about 17 kilometers per second, or 10 miles a second, and has a diameter of around 332 to 338 kilometers across. Honestly, there's just nothing impressive about 705 Interamnia, so I rate it 5 out of 10. Number 4. 10 Hygieia. The fourth on our list is the 10 Hygieia. It's considered the second runner up for the largest asteroids in the asteroid belt. It is 434 kilometers in diameter, 270 miles, and has a mass estimated to be 3% of the total mass of the entire asteroid belt. Anibal de Gaspari discovered Hygieia on the 12th of April, 1849, and it's quite impressive how he did it at the time, given that 10 Hygieia is very dim from the Earth. To observe this massive rock, you'll need to have at least a 100mm telescope, or 4 inches. Number 3. 2 Pallas No, it's not what you think it looks like. 2 Pallas is the third space rock on our list. It's a massive, 512-kilometer-long asteroid, weighing up to 2 sextillion kilograms. Insane! But I bet you it can only fit two football fields inside of it. But anyway, 2 Pallas, although has a number 2 before it, ranks the third in terms of size. Discovered by another German astronomer, Heinrich Wilhelm Matthias Olbers, on the 28th of March, 1802, the former thought it was a planet at that time. In 1801, during the observation of Giuseppe Piazzi, an Italian astronomer, he thought it was just another comet. He later stated that it wasn't a comet, but something different. Losing sight of this asteroid, it was later rediscovered by Baron von Zach and Heinrich W. M. Olbers after getting some help from Carl Friedrich Gauss. Number 2. 4 Vesta the second on our list is this 524-kilometer-long asteroid called 4 Vesta. It has a mass of 2.5 times 10 to the power of 20 kilograms. Remember the guy who discovered 2 Pallas in 1802? The same guy who discovered 4 Vesta six years later? Olbers discovered 4 Vesta after proposing that there might be some asteroids in the same region that he discovered 2 Pallas. And he was right. Damn, this guy never stops. Although he was the one who discovered 4 Vesta, it was all thanks to Carl Friedrich Gauss, whose calculations made an invaluable effort to the discovery of other asteroids. Gauss was given the honor to name the asteroid, and he called it Vesta, after the virgin Roman goddess of home and hearth, Vesta. Number 1. One Ceres If you made it this far, congratulations! This is the most dangerous asteroid on our list. Ceres is the first asteroid to be discovered and observed. With a diameter of 939 kilometers, 583 miles, and a mass of 9.3 times 10 to the power of 20 kilograms, one Ceres is considered the biggest asteroid in the belt and the smallest dwarf planet in the solar system. It was discovered by Giuseppe Piazzi at Palermo Astronomical Observatory on 1st of January 1801 but initially thought it was a planet. It was later classified as an asteroid. For the record, Ceres is four times larger than the Chicxulub meteorite, which is 150 kilometers, 93 miles, and it managed to wipe out 75% of the Earth's species. Now imagine if something like Ceres were to hit Earth. Bruh, we wouldn't survive. I just hope that I'm rich enough to afford a ticket to the newly terraformed Mars colony, only to be killed by Martian demons. And if you like this video, be sure to drop a like and hit the subscribe button. I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.